The sound a bubble makes depends on its size. We can hear this if we release two different sized bubbles. What you can see here is the bubble on the left is giving out the big bubbles. That's the regular blonk, 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 blonk. Yeah. A smaller bubble yeah. coming out of the needle on the right gives you a, a high plink. If it's a different size, it gives you a different note? Pretty much, yes, yes, yes. It just so happens that these kind of millimetre-sized bubbles give out plinks at the frequencies we can hear, right. which is why babbling brooks make a poetical babble that you can hear. If the numbers Fantastic. came out differently, yeah. the babbling brooks would be silent and they'd be, we'd have lost all that poetry. But right. as it is... So, uh, wait a minute. If the bubbles were just they'd come too, way too small, we wouldn't hear yeah, them at all? that's right. That's right. The numbers turn out just right so that the babbling brook and waterfall and such like are musical. Fantastic. Yeah, it's nice. That is quite good, isn't it? Yeah. In a wave, I mean, I, obviously, I've never even thought about trying to count the bubbles in a wave, but we were on the beach yes. a couple of weeks ago, just, and it was just a wall of Atlantic surf, and it was yes. just white.